So tell me about um, the season's winners. You excited about the two finalists? It was interesting. I think what was really exciting was having the final three and taking them all the way to the finale. For the first time ever in our history, we had no idea what was going to happen. Because um, usually, you know, they're sitting around the house, we've got a sense of what the jury's going to do, but the jury didn't even know what they were going to do. That Everything was happening in the moment, and that makes for really exciting TV. So I felt really good about what ultimately happened. I think that we would look at this final three and probably say, what? <laughs> you know, did we expect those three? I mean, if you look at it, they were from each of their cliques in the very beginning and were probably Probably the ones that sort of faded into the background and then survived while everyone else sort of picked each other off. I think there's all different ways of playing the Big Brother game. And you can't say one is right over another, quite honestly. Just because you win competitions doesn't make you the winner of Big Brother. Um, Big Brother, is a, it's, you have to have all different skills. You have to have the social skills to play the social and psychological chess game that this is. And you have to be able to win at the right times in order to stay in the house. Um, and some people also win on personality alone. I mean, look at, not alone, but on personality and, and being a nice person and making themselves really as the least threat they possibly can, a.k.a. Jordan. Do you have a favorite player? I don't usually have favorite players. I really can't. I'm looking at it as a show, and I'm looking at it as telling a great story. Um, and so, you know, at the beginning of the year, do we look? It, it's always fun to look at the group and go, I bet you that person's going to win. And to tell you the truth, we're usually wrong. The only one I ever got right was uh, yeah, Evil, or not Evil Will, but uh, Dr. Will. Um, I thought, I, I saw him, people actually said he wasn't going to make it, and that was the first season I did, and I said, he is going to win this game, and he did. After that, I've been wrong each time. Fortunate. We don't like to have to expel people, but it, we were pushed to the limit with that. She broke rules that were very clear in our rule book that we had discussed with her, and we had no choice, because at that point, that's not the way the game is supposed to be played. We really don't want to be a part of the show, so we don't take that lightly. I really, you know, that night, we, were, we had heavy hearts. It really wasn't, you know, something we want to do. I think she's a beautiful person. I think she's a bright person. I think she's, you know, smart. She was going to go far in this game. And it's really unfortunate because not only did she ruin it for herself, she ruined it for the people in her alliance. And I think, you know, when you talk to Kevin and you talk to Natalie, you'll see, and to Lydia, that at that point they were really thrown for a loop and they had to scramble. And in the end, um, you know, she may have cost them, cost them the game, you know? And so, and that's too bad. Um, but, uh, but as far as her, I think that Laura said it best with the, there are thousands of people out there who would just kill to be in her position and um, she really sort of slapped those people in the face by doing what she did that night. I would just say to anyone who wants to be a Big Brother house guest is go on out and try because the truth is we don't always know what we're looking for. It's about the mix in the group. It's not that we have to have always certain types and I know people say oh yeah you're always looking for this type and that type. The truth is we're looking for the best group mix and I'm always looking for something different. I'm always looking for a way of twisting this up in terms of types of people and personalities and backgrounds that we haven't seen before. So it doesn't matter what you look like. It doesn't matter where you come from. If you're willing to come on in and try this game and play as hard as you can, then come on in and, and give it a shot.